Political killings in Guazul Natal carried out an in loco inspection of Durban's notorious Glebeland hostel in Umlazi today. Earlier this week, the commission heard evidence that the hostel was a haven for hitmen. It's estimated that more than 80 people were killed at the hostel in the last three years. The commission heard of grim operations at the hostel. It's allegedly a haven for hitmen. Scores of people have lost their lives, but no one's been arrested. The murders are blamed on politics, power, financial enrichment and criminality. About 22,000 people are housed in 71 blocks in the vast complex at the entrance to Umlazi. Old and dilapidated buildings stand next to more modern accommodation. Firstly, the very, very poor uh, block 52 and the better area block R and the much, much more improved family units uh, that, that we saw. Um, in, so, so that we actually can have a feel of the place and, and meet the people and, and chat to them. Uh, that, that will all feed into our, our report. Residents of the two blocks inspected are said to be at war with one another. The delegation drew interest when they arrived. The Public Protector's Office has found in its report that the police and the Etikwene Council failed in their mandate to protect victims. They are very keen to, to get to the root of the violence and the killings uh, which have been taking place over the past, in this area possibly about the past three years or so. The Commission adjourned today and is expected to resume on the 16th of August. Renee Heiner, SABC News, Durban.